So let us solve one more problem. Evaluate limit x tends to 0, 3 power x minus 1 by root of 1 plus x minus 1. See, divide both numerator and denominator by x. The numerator can be written as 3 power x minus 1 by x, whereas the denominator can be written as root of 1 plus x minus 1 by x. So, we can apply the limit. So, then we get the answer. So, otherwise, so better rationalize the denominator with its rationalizing factor, then we can solve this problem. Okay. Let us solve the problem. solution limit x tends to 0 3 power x minus 1 by root of 1 plus x minus 1 multiply both numerator and denominator with root of 1 plus x plus 1. So, that means indirectly we are rationalizing. So, now we get limit x tends to 0 3 power x minus 1 divided by root of 1 plus x minus 1 multiplied by root of 1 plus x plus 1 by root of 1 plus x plus 1. Okay. So, now this can be rewritten as limit x tends to 0 3 power x minus 1 So, multiplied by this one root of 1 plus x plus 1 by root of 1 plus x minus 1 multiplied with root of 1 plus x plus 1. See, let us assume root of 1 plus x equals to a, 1 equals to b. Now, this will be in the form of a minus b into a plus b, which equals to a square minus b square. So, let us write in this way. So, now, next step follows limit x tends to 0, 3 power x minus 1 multiplied by root of 1 plus x plus 1. So, using the identity a plus b into a minus b, the denominator can be written as root of 1 plus x whole square minus 1 square. Now, we can write the limit x tends to 0, 3 power x minus 1 multiplied by root of 1 plus x plus 1 by root of 1 plus x whole square is 1 plus x and 1 square is 1 but minus is there minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 gets cancelled. So, now, so we have to split this one as the product of the two limits. So, that means 3 power x minus 1 by x multiplied by root of 1 plus x plus 1 and also we can apply the limit to the both of the functions. So, now, limit x tends to 0, 3 power x minus 1 by x multiplied by limit x tends to 0 root of 1 plus x plus 1. Just observe this limit. This is one of the standard results. So, let me repeat that standard results here. We have limit x tends to 0 a power x minus 1 by x. What does it stand for? It stands for log a to the base e. So, 
this equals to log a to the base e. This is one of the formulae. So, using this result, you can expect the value of limit extends to 0, 3 power x minus 1 by x. So, what is the value of this one? So, that is nothing but log 3 to the base e. So, this can be written log 3 to the base e multiplied by in the place of x replace 0. So, we get root of 1 plus 0 plus 1. So, let it be simplified now. So, this equals to log 3 to the base e multiplied by root 1 is 1, 1 plus 1 that is log 3 to the base e multiplied by 2. So, now we can change the order using commutative property log 3 base e times 2 can be written as 2 times log 3 to the base e. So, this can be written 2 log 3 base e or using logarithmic formula log x to the power of n to the base a is equal to n log x to the base a. Am I correct? So, n log x to the base a con in conversely we can say log x to the power of n to the base a. This we can write log 3 square to the base e. 3 square is 9. So, we get log 9 to the base e is the answer. So, let us solve one more problem. Evaluate limit extends to 3 x square plus 3 x plus 2 divided by x square minus 6 x plus 9. So, let us try, let us substitute directly the limit, let us verify whether we are getting finite value or 0 or sometimes infinity also. So, let us try what we get the problem now. So, let us solve it. Limit extends to 3 x square plus 3x plus 2 divided by x square minus 6x plus 9. So, instead of x replace 3, 3 square plus 3 times 3 plus 2 divided by 3 square minus 6 into 3 plus 9. This is 9 plus 9 plus 2, 9 minus 18 plus 9. So, now let it be simplified now. 18 plus 2 divided by 9 plus 9, 18 and minus 18. So, 20 divided by 0. In general, this is infinity or undefined also in some cases we can say. So, this will be the answer.